guys, this is Rose and today I just want to share to you this mini album that I created. Um, I know it's been a long time since I posted a video on YouTube. I think w more than a year or two years probably. <laughs> because I got busy with some works and some personal stuff. So anyway, so let's get started. So this is the mini album that I created. And it's a shabby shake one. I use um, lots of wild or wild order ah wild orchids craft flowers in front, except this one. This is my handmade flower, and I got a tutorial for that one. And some metal metal thing, the butterfly and the corners. And some lace, and by the way, I before I forgot the paper that I use in this mini album is the the first edition Isabel. I use the eight by eight um, paper pad and also the twelve by twelve paper pad, and I love this mini. I love this paper. I love the the color combination very shabby chic and very pretty so I use that I do I use that collection okay so this is the front one and I got this um, I got this frame in Michaels and these trims I think Melanie gave it to me when we did the swap and and, and as I mentioned, some wild orchid craft flowers in front, and this is the handmade flower that I made. And I also incorporate this uh, beautiful lace that I got from eBay. And as you can see there, I just put that uh, the Tim Holtz um, thing here. And I and I print that happy family there because I'm planning to to put some some family photos since I I just had a baby a month ago and so yeah that's the front one and this is the side it's kind of chunky. So. And this open like this, and also um, for this, I'm planning to move, put something here. Probably I'm gonna change the magnet that I use here because it's not that kind of sticky for the closure. It's not kind of like a strong for the closure. Probably I will change that later. And this is the first page. Okay, so all the flowers that I put here is my is the handmade flowers that I made, and this what do you call this one? This uh, leaves is the Marty Stewart punch, and as you know the Tim Holtz bird cage, and this will open like this. Then I can use it for photo mat or from for journaling, and another one in the back. And and on the binding here, on the binding here, in between the the pages, I put this pretty lace also that I got from eBay, and this second one, and some handmade flowers that I made, and this open like like this, and some photo mat, and I can use this for journaling, and another photo mat here. And I just put that Eiffel Tower there. And also there's a pocket here for a big photo mat and another photo mat and journaling. And the next page is this one. Some handmade flowers. This one, this one, and that one is a handmade flowers. And some more 
wild orchid craft flowers too and I just made that stick pin there and there's three tags in here so can use it like for photo mat and the back I can use it for like journaling and I just stamped the Eiffel, um, yeah, Eiffel Tower there and the next page is this one it's kind of chunky so it's hard to it, it won't open it I mean flat <laughs> because I, of the embellishment that I put there okay so this is the next page and some handmade flowers that I made there and this is the the punch I think Martha Stewart punch and the AK success punch just with that um, dragonfly cut out from I think the C6, C6 die and this open like this room for photo and then there's two more room for photo and then I just use that Martha Stewart, Stewart punch for the corner and there's a waterfall here actually this waterfall can just like a it's just like all the same there you can use that for journaling or photo mat and I just got this from the collection and I can use this for like photo mat and oh, I think I need to fix this later <laughs> anyway I'll do that later I'll fix the flat back pearl there and it's close like this and there's one big photo mat here just like the other one and the next page just make it like a um what you call that one I forgot <laughs> I forgot what to call this kind of um this one hmm anyway you guys know that <laughs> just made a this one is for photo mat and some handmade flowers that I made and there's two little wild orchid craft flowers there and some small butterflies and this one I can use it for like journaling and this one photo spot and just do a little one for journaling as well and it opens like this and there's one room for photo mat on the top and I can use this uh, for journaling or photo mat as well and there's little paper there strip of paper for like journaling too I didn't put any um, wordings on this mini album because uh, maybe I, after I put the photos then I'm gonna uh, do that um, that wordings there and okay so let's go with the next page and this is the next page some more handmade flowers and wild orchid craft flowers in this page I can open it like this I just put the magnet there or I can just um, pull it pull the it's like a card thing on there if I want to put the picture here then I can just do that and there's a, this is the card that I made there's room for a photo and another photo and there's room for like a um, journaling spot not a photo mat, journaling spot here and I can use also this for like photo mat and all the pages as you know there's a big tag here there's a pocket to put this big tag and the next page is 
Okay, so I made some some handmade flower. I like this flower here. And then some wild orchid craft flower and then this one is uh it's like a the Venice lace that I cut out that I cut. And there's Eiffel Tower here. And this one is a card and fold. And there's five tags here. You can just pull out all <laughs> in, in easy for me to show it to you guys. And the back one. Okay, so that's the one. I'll put it back later. And the next page is this pocket page. Ah! And I just made some handmade flowers again and some wild orchid craft flower here. Some butterfly filigree on the top. There's um, two tags. You can use it like a photo mat and in the back for journaling. And this one is like a card again. It's like a photo mat, photo mat. They just put that Eiffel Tower tower there. And another photo mat in the back. And there's a pocket here for big tag. Photo, photo mat and journaling spot and for this last page just make that a uh, flower oh no actually these are the wild orchid graph flowers just add that Martha Stewart punch leaves in here and I just put that Venice lace I cut it and stick it there and there's three photo mat the big one here and in the back there's two photo mat and I can use that top for journaling and this one is for like journaling also I mean yeah journaling spot and I use that Martha Stewart punch here and this one I just made it simple like got the scallop oval here by spellbinders and Put the butterfly filigree there and some wild orchid craft flowers again and I made those two stick pins. And there you go. That's my mini album that I created. And hope hope you guys like it. Let me know what you think. I'm working on another mini album right now, so Probably next this coming week I'm gonna post it that I'm gonna post that one too. So hopefully you guys like it and thanks for watching. Bye for now.